So, what did you think of the Disney Princess show? I loved it. It was quite good to be fair. Um, I'm not ashamed to admit that I love the Disney princesses and if I'm honest, I do enjoy meeting them as well. Um, but yeah, that was a cool show, I like that. Um, I sort of filmed bits and bobs of it. Uh, the actual princess has come out and it was like the, um, the actual storyline was there was two people presenting it. One was English, speaking English, was speaking French. And the French guy hadn't done his homework and didn't know the princess's stories and had to give them like a um, fan and stuff like that. And um, it was quite good because he kept like giving them the wrong ones and they had to work out during this dance. It was quite fun and at the end all the princes came out and they danced together. Um, it was really good to be fair. Um, although the song literally, some of the, the lyrics were something like, every little girl wants to wake up and be someone special. Is that what it said? Yeah, and I was a bit like, mm. I wake up every day and this little girl is always someone special. Alright, so don't give me that rubbish. Alright, but honestly, yeah, really, really good show. Really enjoyed it. We're now going to go and do the Alice Maze, I think. Okay. So we were going to do Alice's Curious Maze, but, um, or Curious Labyrinth, but we can't because it's shut, it shuts at five. So um, if you're coming here for the one day or whatever, 24 hours or something like that, or two days, but get it done early because we're obviously going to have to, we've got a chance to do it tomorrow, which is fine. But um, yeah, it's, it looks pretty cool. I'll show you from the outside anyway. We will definitely, we'll properly vlog in it tomorrow, but this is it here. It's pretty well kept to be fair. And then you got the uh, Cheshire Cat at the back there. And then the actual sign, Alice's Curious Labyrinth, is pretty cool. And then you come down here, look, it's here. That's a pretty cool sign. And then, um, yeah, 11 till 5. And there's a bit over here, which is um, Alice's, uh, the Mad Hat's Tea Pie. I'll show you this over here. And actually, there's a place called March Hair where you can get some food. It's super cute. So this is the man's hat, his tea pilot. How cute is that in there? It's pretty busy, I'm gonna struggle to get a picture. And then there's, this is the March Hare. It's like, uh, I'm guessing it's like the White Rabbit's house. Yeah, it's very similar. And then March Hare refreshments. That is super cute. Uh, oh, let me see what kind of things I do, shall we? Crepes, stuff like that. Ooh, Mickey cake. It's pretty reasonable for a crepe with sugar, 3.29. You don't wanna go to Ben's? My mum's gonna love them. But yeah, so that's pretty cool. And the seating area around here is super cute. And they've actually got special seating just for the 25th anniversary. Look, here it is here, look. So it's actually the 25th anniversary cup. That's super cute. We're gonna get a picture for it now anyway. Charlotte's gonna want a picture in it. But look, she's getting, uh, working hard on that Instagram, guys. Just for you. Oh, just the other side of this fence, though, is the Mad Hat Tea Party, which is the spinning cups. Um, yeah, so we're gonna get some pictures and we'll let you know what we're doing afterwards. So there's this weird gate open, which you're about to see as we walk through here. As we're going Fantasyland, there's like this weird gate open, and it's like a passageway, we're not sure, through to Discovery Land. Ooh. It's like, ooh, what's around the corner? Ooh. I think I know, I think it's Discovery Land. What makes you think it's Discovery Land? Oh yeah, I'll probably bring you out your right near the um, Star Tours bit. I haven't seen it from this side yet, so that's pretty awesome. Oh, okay. We've got a good amount of space back here. They could actually get something in, like some kind of ride. I don't know if the other side of that hill, but we'll see. Oh, okay, look. Oh, okay, it's Cafe Por it's Cafe Hoporion, isn't it? So if I'm correct, out here to the left should be Okay, so this is a little seating area, that's quite cool. Yeah, yeah, it might be just a little smoking area or something like that. But that's the Cafe Hyporeon where we had that breakfast that morning. And we're probably going to have breakfast tomorrow morning, actually. Um, but we come in through the other side, which is right through the other side of this restaurant here. Um, but yeah, you're right, Charlotte, it's just it's, um, Star Tours. So yeah, that's cool. Anyway, we're going to go by Space Minus. We'll see you in a minute, guys. So we've just been on Space Mountain and we're now going to go in here. We don't actually know what it is. It's called Nautilus. It looks actually quite cool to be fair. But we're going to go in and have a look, shall we? See what's inside. Hmm. Let's go and have a look. Thank you. It's 
very warm in here compared to outside. Oh, we're going deeper. Yeah, single riders. Yes. Sorry to... Yeah. Oh, okay. Follow us down, down, down this corridor, please. This place is so cool. Where are we even going? We're underneath the this water. Me about the yeah, we're underneath the water. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Very similar to Splash Mountain. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Very similar to Splash Mountain. This is the king, Captain Nemo. Beautiful. Oh, Oh my goodness! What is this? Look at these! Should we go left first? Oh, wait, it's a chamber. Is there a little chamber? Guys, there's a submarine. Did I not say to you the other day? They're on a boat and a play together because you've done a submarine. Yeah. <laughs> oh wow, look in here! At the captain's quarters. Look at this little bed. Look! This way! No, it doesn't move. It's the actual Nautilus, look, and there's like the lagoon that we're supposed to be in. Oh my god, look at that. What's in here? Oh, look! <laughs> Diving equipment. You dive in there, and there's your equipment. Oh, whoa! What? Oh, that scared me. Look at that. <gasps> oh, look, Davy Jones. You go left, I go right. Ooh. This must be the engine room. This place is so cool. So, if you're ever wondering what you're wondering, this place is, it's just outside the exit to Space Mountain. So, as you come out, it's a bit called Nautilus, and you're actually, it's like there's a big Nautilus ship on the actual lake outside, Hyperspace Magnum. It's awesome. It's like a big loop all the way around, and you come back out the same entrance. But yeah, oh, what a... What, what? Wow, look at that. We're going to have to get a picture of this, guys. So yeah, if you look for the optimum Instagram point, then uh, it's right here. As you come out here, you stand there, you get the amazing view of that, and the Nautilus as well. But, uh, how cool is this little turnstile to get out? It's actually paddles, look. Whoa. Come on, boy! Okay, so we are now on their version of Tomorrowland Speedway, which I think is something get called the way! Autopia. Just getting a uh, road rage. And we are, oh, I let him drive this time, because when we were in Florida, I drove. So, as you can see, he has to make Yahoo! it. Everything pretty competitive, but I'm gonna show you the track because um, everything looks super pretty. So let me just turn around and show you. Don't get that close to his car. I'm not hitting, there's a rule. The rules are no bumping. Go on, put your foot down. Put your foot down. Get out of the way. Oh Oh my god. Yeah! Woo! Ah! This one's cool. I recommend coming in the dark. Look at all the lights. Whoa, no hands! <laughs> ah! Ooh, I like it. <laughs> Look how high we are. You can't really see because the lights, but... Go, go, go. Down! Go, go, yes! Paddle to the metal! Yes! Yahoo! Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> that was an accident, Nat! What? Yeah, shut up, woman. 
Guys, I don't know how well the camera is picking at this up, but Discovery Land, which is Florida's tomorrow, la oh, Paris's tomorrow land rather, is amazing at night. Just look at all the lights. It's beautiful. Okay guys, we're riding the Buzz Lightyear shooting ride. It's just that she's broken down, so I thought I'd quickly vlog. Charlotte's done well. It's 314,200. I've got to max it out. That's not an error. That is just straight up me shooting and hitting the points. I've done so freaking well. Oh my God, I've hit a million. Oh! So I've, I've calmed down a little bit. You saw me going crazy on the buzz ride. This is the thing like, I've never scored that high on a ride before, like this kind of shooting ride. I got 1,123,600. That was, honestly, I got so high that the picture, the ride picture where it tells you to score underneath, had to start recounting, because it doesn't tell you when you get over a million. But you've seen it, we went 99999, then it starts saying ah, 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 because I'd scored the highest score. Honestly, that is. I'm so excited. I. <laughs> anyway, we're now going to walk back through Disney Village. I'm going to grab a milkshake from McDonald's and um, I think we're going to pop into World of Disney so we can buy something which you'll see in the Disney Hall, or you would have seen in the Disney Hall. Um, so, yeah, we'll probably see you either in the room or somewhere like that. See you in a minute, guys. Okay. So we've just come out of the park, out of the Disneyland park. We've done a bit of shopping in World of Disney and we've just come past this little 25th anniversary store. But I wanted to show you what they sell. Look at this. So they sell your usual lollies and stuff. But look at this monster. That one there. And then there's this one. 50 euros. God damn. But here as well, they also sell things like all the sweets and stuff. Look, and they also do macaroons. Can I get some? I'm just looking at it. What do you want? Hello? Mm, look at their macaroons. So cute. Yes. These are really cute as well, look. Hello, can I please get a box of seven macaroons, please? Can you get the pasta? Just look at this shop, though. It's so colourful. And then look, there was a big queue for this one. No queue for the fruit one. How sad. Anyway, we're gonna get these macaroons and then we're heading to McDonald's, so we'll see you in a minute. I think we're gonna finish the vlog today for right now because um, when we get in the room, I'm gonna jump in the shower and then get straight in bed. Um, we've got one full day left at the park tomorrow. Uh, and we're gonna try, we're gonna stay right till the end because we want to go to, um, uh, the actual show, so Illuminations, which is what it is at the minute for the 25th anniversary. Um, so we'll be doing that. Also, tomorrow evening, so sort of about whew, half nine, I think, we're probably going to try and ride Phantom Manor. Because Phantom Manor in the dark, not that it's any different, will be cool. Um, and we also want to ride uh, the mine train as well, uh, Thunder Mountain, because it would be sick um, to be able to get on that in the dark and ride it like in the dark. It'd be cool like this because it'll be lit up and stuff. So yeah, we're now going to bed. Uh, we hope you enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you enjoy watching our videos, and uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Anyway, so yeah, uh, it's a good night from Charlotte and it's a good night from me. So that's a good night from Tangled Life. Good night, guys. Mister? Jess? Go ahead. You can go inside. Hello.